What musical instrument do you want to play? This instrument is called a flute. Flutes create a very high-pitched sound, and they make sound by blowing over a small hole in the head joint. This instrument is called a clarinet. Clarinets are the second highest pitch behind the flute. They're recognized by their dark black color and silver keys. This instrument is called a saxophone. Saxophones are a very popular instrument. They create beautiful sounds, and their sounds can be heard in music like jazz music from New Orleans, Louisiana. These small pieces of wood are called reeds, and saxophones and clarinets, as we talked about earlier, both need them in order to produce a sound. This next instrument is called a French horn, and it is the first brass instrument we have talked about. In order for brass instruments to produce a sound, they have to be buzzed through on a mouthpiece. And French horns are recognizable by their circular shape and wide bell. This instrument is called a trumpet, and this is another very popular instrument. This brass instrument can play notes as high as a flute can, or even as low as a French horn. This instrument is called a trombone. You may have seen a trombone in a movie or two, as they're very popular. It can be recognized by its long shape. The next instrument we will talk about is the baritone. Baritones are a low brass instrument, which means they play pretty low notes. They are often confused with the next instrument we will talk about. This instrument is called a tuba, and based off of appearances, it's easy to see how it gets confused with baritones. Tubas play very, very low notes, usually the bass lines in music. The tubas pictured above are actually called sousaphones because these are marching tubas. Now we will talk about percussion instruments. This instrument is called a snare drum, and it produces sounds by being hit on the top of the drum head with drumsticks and different rhythms. This instrument is called a timpani. Timpanis are similar to snare drums because they are hit on the top of the drum head with drumsticks in order to produce sound. But timpanis create lots of different sounds because there are multiple drums. This next instrument is called a xylophone. Xylophones produce sound by being hit on their keys with mallets, and each key produces a different sound. This is a triangle, and they are played by holding the string at the top of the triangle and hitting it with the triangle stick. They can only produce one note or one sound, but they can create many different rhythms. The last instrument that we will talk about is called the tambourine. Tambourines are played by holding one side and hitting the other with your hand or leg. These also only create one sound like the triangle, but they are very fun to play. I hope that you enjoyed learning about all the instruments and found one that you would like to play.